What are you gonna make? Something that spins and uh, looks cool. How big should I make it, Colin? Five seems good, yeah. Five wheels? Yeah. All right, throwing it off. Yeah, I got rid of that. I'm using the shortcuts over my shoulder. Well, oh, that's cool. All right, I'm gonna build it up, up into the sky. <laughs> Kinda looks like a creepy virus. <laughs> oh, that's pretty cute, <laughs> that's yeah. Pretty nice. Yeah, it goes in a circle. All right, gotta make this cooler though. Just kind of put the gold ball on top. <laughs> little, uh, little decoration. We play video games, we make video games, we live video games. And we can do it from anywhere. Turkey, Malta, Scotland, Japan, Honduras, Mexico, Namibia, probably some more of Europe. We do everything together, including making games. We've worked together on a lot of projects over a lot of years. I love working with you. I love working with you. Yeah, 2008 was the original Fantastic Contraption. It was completely online, in browser, and... Right now, in 2015, it's a VR game, so it sets you in virtual reality. Previous games I've worked on, I end up doing a lot of the tech for the art, but the artist can now actually produce effects and work on his own shaders. If you think that you've tried VR, but you haven't tried with your hands in it yet, with hand controllers, you should try room scale VR. It's incredibly fun to work in VR because nobody knows what they're doing. We're just like on this crazy spaceship going through the unknown. So I think creativity is when two ideas kind of mash into each other and then some new combination of things come out. You should always be putting yourself into the world in places that are new to you and looking for experiences you haven't had before. Because that's the stuff that ends up in your brain, like bumping into each other and making new stuff. And the more crazy things you have up there, the more stuff is gonna come out of it. I would just wanna do stuff that has never been done before. I wanna have an impact on the history of my chosen medium. I wanna have some bit of craft that gets used everywhere, and then people point back and they're like, oh yeah, Fantastic Contraption was the first place to do that. I, I'm all about pushing the creative boundaries because isn't like the entire point of being in creative work, like being creative, isn't the entire point making something that the world has never seen before? Pushing the boundary of what people know, like that's what you should be doing. That's why you're doing it to begin with because we want to be one of the first. We want to be like riding that tidal wave as it crashes into the world. I just want to be a part of it. I don't want to, I don't want to miss out. And obviously like the winds of fate, like when you know, you're looking at the riverbank, you can jump on logs that come by and like VR is the log that I've jumped on. I'm like, we'll see. <laughs> I can hear something ahead. I don't know if it's the roar of a crowd or a waterfall, but I guess we'll find out. <laughs>